Hey Satch, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support and I hope all is well with everyone. Today we are going to find out what are your important love messages. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not apply to each and every one of you. Okay Satch, spirits and angels, please show me important accurate love messages for Sagittarius today. Show me more. Such, so, please bear in mind that roles can be switched in this reading. Could either be you or the person whom you are thinking about or dealing with. We've got the King of Wands here at the bottom of the deck. This is actually your energy. Spirit's definitely telling you to mm, know your power. Know your power, okay? And also, we've got the star here in reverse. This, for me, may indicate an energy of either you or your person finding it really hard to recover from a separation from the past or finding it really hard to forgive somebody, okay? And also, we've got this six of pentacles here in reverse i'm willing to give any more because somebody may have been hurt in the past and preferring to be alone and indulging in whatever um and whatever that makes them happy it could be you or your person okay but also such i feel like this could be a message from the spirit to indulge okay nine of cups here be a little bit more selfish <laughs> for once um if you've been way too giving because six of pentacles here can also indicate somebody a little bit too generous okay so eight of pentacles here in reverse also this may indicate i feel hmm, there's an energy of somebody not wanting to work on a certain connection right now because they are really unhappy the sun here in reverse or somebody could be hiding something but also we've got the four pentacles here in reverse this um i feel like this may indicate somebody letting go of this connection because they are unhappy it could be you or your person yep and also we've got the eight of swords here somebody could be over analyzing thinking overthinking feeling really stuck however wanting to offer you love here nine of cups this person may be a pisces cancer scorpio virgo gemini or aquarius libra can be any sign okay however I feel like no actions are being taken right now but in the future perhaps because we've got the magician here perhaps it could be you or your person wanting to take actions wanting to offer love here with the knight of cups where the magician may indicate somebody wanting to make something happen wanting to manifest you into their life or them wanting to manifest or it could go vice versa <laughs> so okay let's see more Okay, so we've got the Queen of Cups and the Nine of Cups. For some of you, there could be an age difference between you and somebody here, okay? Um, hmm. The Hermit here in reverse and the Page of Wands here in reverse. I do sense somebody stepping up. It could be you, it could be your person, somebody here wanting to step up, perhaps wanting to take action because Page of Wands is in reverse here and we've got the King of Wands in the upright position. So the King of Wands in the upright is way better than the Page of Wands here in reverse. Queen of Cups is here. There is somebody here still finding it really hard to move on with the Six of Swords here in reverse, feeling really, really stuck. Page of Pentacles here in reverse. This either may indicate somebody not ready to talk or not ready to reply a message or messages however the hermit is in reverse here so it does look like somebody is wanting to come out from their hermit mode and finally take actions but feeling a little bit stuck perhaps could be delaying it okay delaying taking actions because of the past all right because i feel like the eight of pentacles here may indicate somebody moving on it feels like a somebody making a u-turn returning okay and two of cups here is in reverse this indicates a separation because somebody may have been either a non committal because the nine of wands here in reverse can indicate somebody who also could be a player or may have a bad attitude <laughs> or just need to grow up not ready to settle down there's an energy here that i feel somebody may have not been ready to really settle down but i do sense somebody stepping up here okay from a page to a knight and then to becoming a king because the king is the upright position so i'm gonna read the king as the last card as in as in uh 
the third level. I hope you. I hope it makes sense to you. But anyway, the emperor. Uh, sorry, the empress is in reverse, and with the five of cups here in reverse, and the queen of pentacles, you could be dealing with a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Five cups here in reverse can indicate. Mm, a message where spirits are trying to tell you, tell you to see the glass half full, then it is half empty. And there's an energy, the Empress, for some of you, if you've been married to this person or if you, you are married to this person, I don't know, there is an energy of somebody feeling like they no longer want to nurture anymore and they just want to take care of themselves right now, taking care of their own well-being. It could be you or your person. And the lovers here is in reverse. This indicates a choice. But there are two cards here that for some some of you, if you're dealing with somebody or you could, you, if you're in a third party situation, it just feels like somebody could be walking away from the third party, okay, towards you, or you could be walking away from a third party towards them, okay. Somehow the sun here in reverse still indicates a lot of unhappiness. Being the sun as a major kind of want to spirits trying to tell you if you're unhappy with a magician here, you can you can you can reverse that, okay? It's actually completely up to you. It feels like the ball is actually in your court, okay? You can make that decision. And there's an energy of somebody also divorcing, that's what I'm getting. Divorcing somebody. Mm, not saying you could be the third party if your person is involved with uh, it's married to somebody else that's just for some of you okay but spirit's definitely saying to know your worth know your value take care of yourself first your own well-being especially with the star here in reverse um i feel like there is an energy whether it's you or your person but somebody here is drinking way too much with the nine of cups here okay lack of balance lack of control here in regards to their drink that's a drinking problem here i don't know whether it's you or your person uh you should know where you stand in the storyline okay love is definitely still there queen of cups somebody perhaps still loves you but the queen of cups looking towards the left and the knight of cups is looking towards the right somebody could still be mulling over the past whatever that has happened or stuck in the past okay Hmm. There are a lot of court cards here, Satch. Um, for a lot of you, I feel like you could be dealing with somebody or you could be in a third party situation like a love triangle. Not all of you, okay? If you're not involved in a love triangle situation, this is definitely not the reading for you. But I definitely sense that... Um, be saying don't overthink and just do it okay with the magician here just take actions that's what i'm hearing it's really completely up to you hmm. all right sash this is your reading hope you resonated if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm gonna leave you with a playlist on the screen right now this is the playlist from my second vlog channel if you're interested to check it out and also um Saj, i post your videos almost every single day however at different timing if you like to be notified every time when i post your videos don't forget to hit on the bell notification button all right take care Saj. bye